Good morning and welcome back to Planet Old History. Today we are going to discuss what if Goku was replaced by Ang. Last time on What If Goku Was Replaced by Ang, the Galactic Emperor Frieza didn't destroy Planet Vegeta, no. This time he destroyed a different planet, the planet of the Four Element Banders. That planet was almost united by one nation in particular, the Fire Nation. But during the war the Frieza forces landed on the planet and the war came to a quick end. Many Banders became formidable soldiers within the Frieza forces and the rumor spread across the Frieza forces that a strong fighter, the Avatar, would bend all four elements and have an incredible strength. Seeing how strong these Banders were and how unique their abilities were, Frieza didn't want to take a risk and blasted his planet into oblivion. Only some Banders survived. But the following question remains, is the Avatar still alive? Find out in What if Goku was replaced by Ang? What if Goku was replaced by Ang? Grandpa Gohan went out of his house and discovered a baby in the forest. It looked like a human and there was no particular body part in there which looked different. Grandpa Gohan adopted this baby and called him, you guessed it, Goku. But in this scenario we will continue calling him Ang. Ang would grow up just like Goku but Ang would always be a peaceful kid and he would have a pacifist character. Only on one day when Ang got upset he transformed and started to glow. Grandpa Gohan was worried and Ang suddenly blew a huge airway which threw Grandpa Gohan off guard but due to Grandpa Gohan's experience he managed to punch Ang and he would suddenly calm down. Also because of the fact that Ang didn't change his body size, well he couldn't crush Grandpa Gohan and thus Grandpa Gohan he would survive. Grandpa Goron told him that he started to glow and was able to make air pressure. When did you learn that, boy? I don't know, Grandpa. I can't remember anything. You must learn to control your emotions, Goku. And if you can control this power, you can always protect yourself. Grandpa Goron taught Anne for some years all the martial arts he knew and with him staying alive, Ang would be even stronger than Goku and have some more social skills as well. Bulma still comes for the Dragon Balls and Gohan would give it to her afterwards. Ang would go along with Bulma because, well, she promised to take care of him and also vice versa, where much of the story would remain unchanged except for the fact that Grandpa Gohan was alive. Ang and Krillin would become Master Roshi's students and no Ang wouldn't be bald in here. He would have hair. During the training however Ang would mention very often something about visions and voices that would talk to him about a certain past. Hmm, what could this mean? In our world we would deem this person as crazy but Master Roshi would probably know of the avas avatar state of Ang due to Grandpa Gohan being alive. The Avatar state wouldn't be called like that of course. Also Master Roshi noticed that Aang didn't really use Ki to make these airway formations but Aang somehow manipulated or banded air or so it seems. Master Roshi told Aang that after their tournament he should climb Corrin's tower. He may have an answer to Aang's problems. In the 21st World Martial Arts Tournament, Jackie Chun would still win and later on, Ang would be confronted with the Red Ribbon Army. Another difference we would see is the fight against Mercenary Tao. Seeing how Mercenary Tao killed Bora and how Upa got sad about it, 
Ang would transform into his avatar state and mercenary Chao would have no chance of surviving. And without the avatar state, Ang and Tao would have been evenly matched. But with the avatar state, well, there was just no chance for Tao to escape. Ang would then get to know Corin, but still have no answers why he has these memories and these outbursts or episodes as they would call it. Corin would suggest to Ang to keep his emotions under check and that snatching the sacred water from him would be a good test for it. Corin stated how he took Master Roshi three years but eventually Ang would get the fake water and with that training and some placebo effect his power increased or well maybe it didn't but th his spirit would still be restless. I still believe that Ang could make a similar damage or even more damage to the Red Ribbon Army than Goku. For one, he would be under immense stress and pressure. Secondly, the Red Ribbon Army wanted to use the Dragon Balls for a bad wish. And thirdly, when he would transform into the Avatar state due to the things I mentioned before, his blows would be more deadly and harsh. Aang would not have a real balance between pacifism and revengeism. After defeating the whole Red Ribbon army, Ang would meet Fortune Teller Baba and when he fights he would not see Grandpa Gohan in there because, well, Grandpa Gohan is still alive. But someone with a blue arrow on his head, a mask, tall figure and the attacks that this person would use, they seemed so natural to Ang. The use, air blows and this masked person made powerful moves which Ang also imitated with ease. Grandpa Goron was there with Bulma, Krillin, Yamcha etc. And Grandpa Goron had a suspicion of who this masked fighter was. He watched into his hidden eyes and both of them nodded. Grandpa Goron and the masked fighter. Ang came out as a winner and the masked person told Ang how he should appreciate his grandpa and his friends and find peace in them and be happy with what he has right now. Never should he succumb to the emotions and kill or take revenge because after all the air nomads they would still keep uh, their way of life. Ang asked the Masked Fighter why he said so and the Masked Fighter told him that eventually he will figure it all out. Oh and thanks Mr. Gohan, is it? Thanks for taking care of Ah, uh, I mean Goku. <laughs> you are welcome. The Masked Fighter went back to the other world and some of these words that he said reasoned ve very well with Ang. Because after all, as an air nomad, pacifism was important. During his training in the turtle school, Ang would try to keep calm and meditate. His fighting style would take a turn from here on, and not only that, Ang would be able to mimic and use the techniques that Goku would know in those years as well, but Ang would also invent his own techniques and try to move air or air band. Master Roshi wouldn't be able to help him with that. And suddenly Ang would also discover that he could move water and do tricks with it. Will this help him in the 22nd World Martial Arts Tournament? And that's where we leave it for now. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed my video. Be sure to like and subscribe, leave a comment, support me also on Patreon and join my forum forum.planetalthistory.ga Until next time on Planet Alt History